What's up guys, Mike here. I'm bringing you guys a special video guys. This is NBA 2K15, the Makare glitch. And um, people have been having a lot of questions about it. Mainly, um, how do you do it with wireless internet connection without the LAN cable and stuff. And today I'm going to show you guys how to do that. So basically it's the same method. You just, you're not using the LAN cable basically. So you already know, to start this off, you got to go to options right here and features. And then you want to go ahead over to options game pay settings want to throw that on hall of fame the highest difficulty and throw it on the uh quarter length of your choice i like three three or four is nice i like three and everything else keep it keep that the same you can turn your game speed up i got mine on 60 you know move kind of fast and stuff like that but uh basically you want to change your difficulty and your quarter length that's all mainly uh i'll change those two you can mess with that if you want to go down to user sliders this is when you want to put game style on custom and put everything on 100 besides let me see it should be fatigue you want to put fatigue rate on zero you don't want to put on 100 you will get tired quick so zero right here and i don't have my files uh my files i got those zero also so all this for here from backdoor cuts all the way up to the inside shot i believe yep inside shots it says all that on 100 so back down to that go to cpu sliders same thing put on game style custom everything on zero but besides on their part you want to put fatigue rate on 100 so they will fatigue quicker than you will and put uh i put a three point shot up so they can take shots quicker not hold the ball and look there and waste time so they'll shoot all the time and i get rebounds that'll help you out and people who want dead eye you want to turn this up to 100 they will contest your shot you're going to make it regardless you get dead eye probably that game no matter how long you shoot, I mean, how uh, often you're going to score. And after that, guys, that's pretty much it. You just got to leave that alone. Exit out right here. And this is the part we're going to um, talk about more. Basically, what you want to do, guys, you want to go ahead and press the PS button one time. Go over to settings. And go down to network. And leave that right there. And then you want to double tap the PS button two times. And then you're back to 2k so two times get you back to what screen you left off of like the iphone you press it two times and show your windows with all you have open so two times you're back to network we're going to cut that off boom cut it back on boom and there's the glitch so two times back to the window and with this you won't you don't want to let your player load completely until your my career you want to let it blink two times or one time and then you want to go back to the here cut that off two seconds and then cut it back on so I would demonstrate first. I suggest you watching me do it, then rewind the video back, then do it yourself. So you just want to press triangle, load up your my player, and it should blink two times. Then you want to double tap here, cut your Wi-Fi off, three seconds, one, two, three, cut it back on, double time again, they're gonna give you the error. They're gonna give you another error. You just wanna wait for it to load back up. And then guys wait for it to simply load back up into the main menu um right now then you want to go to quick game that's what you want to you want to go to quick game you want to press circle guys then you want to go straight into another a quick game basically and then what you want to do guys is find the team you are on and um i made a mistake here i thought i was on my original team but i got drafted to another team um, I, i'm on the clippers now and if you are a starter you will see your name my name is michael bellamy right there Third person you will see your name on there but if you're just starting off you want like a 10 day contract what you can do wait for the game to press x and press triangle when you press triangle you're going to show the lineup then basically you should see your name on that list if, it, if your name is not on that list then you got to do the glitch over again but it's real easy because all the hard stuff is done so if your name not on the list you did something with your wi-fi wrong and you just want to redo it and right here you want to run offense through you that's very important if you want to get the ball quicker and you can get the glitch started but yeah guys if you don't see you don't see your name just redo it and then you will see it guaranteed and um basically put point of emphasis run through you you can get the ball quicker and basically when the game start you're going to see the nav screen and guys all you want to do next guys you're going to see the nav screen you can see mine is not on there but if you just go to start go to quit rematch and when you rematch the nav screen going to come back right back up to where uh, it should be there you go bottom left and the trick to do this basically is when you get the ball if the opponent get the ball it's not going to work yet you got to wait for your, your team to get the ball 
that's how I found out. People did it differently. They just press circle and it works. For my glitch, I gotta have the ball in my hand in order to press circle to get to my my career, the calendar and everything else, guys. So basically, you can see they just they're gonna run out the clock. Everything on zero. They can't do nothing themselves. They just robots. So guys, you're gonna get the ball and you're just gonna press circle just one time. As soon as you give your player the ball, and if if you're on a 10 day contract, you can keep when, you, when your team get the ball, press circle. And you're gonna it's gonna show up. So if you're a starter, give yourself the ball, press circle. It's gonna work. Watch how I pass myself the ball. Watch when it press circle. Boom. I do it again. I got the ball. Press circle again. Boom. It's gonna show up. Then there you go. You're basically in my career, basically, and everything is set back to how we had it was. Hall of Fame. Three minutes. You can check that by going to your options right here. Gameplay settings, and as you can see, everything is still the same. Hall of Fame, three minutes. Game speed, 60. And what I do to save it, because you want it, you want to trick the game into saving it. What I do to save it, you can easily go to your uh, your wardrobe, your my part, go in there and go back out and save. But to secure it, what I do, I sim a whole game, go to my calendar, and I sim a whole basketball game. Basically, that would save everything. Basically, when you sim that one game against uh, my boy Andrew Wiggins. Either you win or loss, it's gonna work. The similar game, and then wait, what you wanna do, you don't wanna quit. You don't wanna go to start and quit. You don't wanna do that. You wanna press the PS home button. Then you wanna go to options. Then you wanna go to close application. So you wanna go to press options, close application. And then what you wanna do is go right back into NBA 2K15 and load up your My Career Player. And I will show you guys the glitch. We'll show you guys that it's working. And if it's not, we can show you guys what to see if it's not working. Okay, guys, and then, guys, all from here, what you want to do is basically let's see if it worked. And uh, to confirm that, you can go right to your settings or options, go to gameplay settings. And, and as you can see, Hall of Fame is still there. Three minutes and our 60 is minutes, 60 game speed is still there. And another way you can farm it, if you did sim a game, you can go back to the game they sim, bam. So, it works guys, I can show you like, basically all you can do guys, you can make unlimited shots guys, just go for your badges, what you want, what you want, and you will get them way quicker, way quicker. These are the ones I got, I been did a glitch, I got my dead eye a few days ago, I got all these a few days ago. As you can see, pick and roll, pick a pocket. Transition finisher and all the rest of them is a uh, personality badges, but as you can see, I got badges real quicker than the average time it took. So upgrading slowly, 74 overall right now. Yeah, guys. So try to get a uh, good contract if you want a 10 day contract. Try to get a good team. You'll get higher payout. So I get you get like a thousand per game. So guys, you hit like all kind of shots. So guys, please did this help you? Please leave a like. Any questions, I'm here to help you. If you need any more help, you can just comment. I'll help you out. Promise. So, uh, this is the wireless method. The LAN method is way more easier. But this is easy also. So, guys, please like the video. Any questions, comment. Have a good day. Enjoy the Walking Dead. I made a video on Sunday. It might not be uploaded at Sunday. But enjoy the Walking Dead tonight.